this is going to be a fun one. And it's going to be quite a hard, not hard sell, but a hard convince. Because for months now, I've been telling you how I love scale up. And I do love scale up. Uh, an AI writer that also does SEO and it's got loads of other tools. And now I'm going to tell you that the likes of Jasper and, and ScaleNut are nowhere near as good as what I'm about to show you. Even if you're not into these AI writers, you want to watch this video because this is really unique. It is more expensive. I'll tell you straight. It does cost more. But what it does is amazing. It doesn't use the same engines that Jasper and ScaleNut and all these AI writers use to create the content. And bear in mind that Google is kind of going to war against these AI writers because... It wants people to read real content. It wants the people who are just genuine, making articles, typing away, to have a chance. And that's fair enough. So this tool that I'm about to show you, and I'm going to put a link in the description so that once you've seen how it works, you can try this out for free for yourself. Um, it'll give you a couple of credits so you can work it out. It creates truly unique full blog articles which are SEO optimized. That, and here's the big thing, will not be flagged up by Google as AI. It goes out of its way to create an AI article that nobody thinks will be AI. And I'll tell you what, the proof will be in the pudding because we're going to put it to the test and we're going to put these websites up, these articles up on my website and see how they fly. All right, so let's jump in and let's have a look at content that scales. Here is the dashboard. Um, now, as I say, you will also get a few free credits if you click on the link in the description and you can try it out for yourself. So you click on Projects. And you click create a new project and you tell it about your website. Let's just pause it while I fill in these details. OK, so the first part is to create your project details. And this is basically the website that you're going to be posting your blogs on. So we're just going to use my Phil's Deals website, project name, Phil Review software, uh, the context of the project, Phil Reviews. And I've got to put find finds deals on the latest software for business, content creators and entrepreneurs, finding the best AI tools. Um, content creation software. Uh, and basically, I'm trying to find software for people that helps them save time and money and helps them grow. That's what I'm trying to do. I think that's right, isn't it? Yeah. Uh, who's my target audience? You. <laughs> uh, entrepreneurs, content creators, small business owners, business owners. OK, so I'm going to post four times a month, hopefully. I want my uh, reviews to be informative and I want my articles to be around two to three thousand words. And I create the project. And now it's going to find my first. So what's the... Um, so we'll pause now while I fill in this bit and have a think. Just give me a second. So, yeah, all right, we'll go for new AI tools 2023. All right. Um, and what AI tools will help your business grow in 2023? What new software is going to be released this year that will change the way you work? All right, I think, are we happy with that, everybody? This is my first time, so I will improve these things. We always say with AI, and I've said it before, and I'll say it again, it's only as good as what you put in. But... It's going to create my content now. Are we happy with that? I think so. Let's just go for it. This is going to take time. We'll pause the video. I'll tell you how long it takes. And I'll uh, come back once the article's been created. Right, so here we go. My article has been created. And I've done a little bit of playing, but not a lot. So your article's created. I've done nothing. I've not changed it. It's uh, going to be called New AI Tools 2023. Unlock your potential with the latest AI. All right, so uh, I've not done a lot of change in here. I changed the... Um, I made sure that the main keyword, which is new AI tools 2023, appears in the title because it was telling me there. I've added some images to the I, to the article. There's my full article. I've added these images in, just went on Canva and created these images. OK, stuck them in the article. Uh, and there's a and I've got lots of ticks here. Um, I can't work out how to change these two things, but I'm just going to go with it now. So there you go. An article that I have done nothing with that has been created uh, that we're going to put on the website now. OK, so we're ready to put the article onto my website. A couple of things that aren't quite there with it. And if I was going to spend a lot more time, it's got too many words to the words in the articles that are appealing in the top 10 in Google, you can see. But I'm not worried because I'm trying to build authority with these articles so that if people are looking for AI tools, they will tend to come to my website because Google shows them. I've got too many headings, but again, I'm not bothered. It's a longer article. Uh, and you can see the article here. and all else. The only other things I've done to the article is I've just inserted these images you can see that I just created very quickly in Canva. Uh, where are they? I just created these in Canva and uh, put them into the article because it recommends that you do. And that is the article, basically. And now here is the article showing on my website. New AI Tools 2023 is there. Uh, that's what it looks like on the article on my website. 
And I, I've got a well-read article. I'm going to share it on Twitter now, tweet it up there, get it out there. People might read it. And we're just going to see how it does. But you can see that it's an interesting spin on AI because it literally creates a full article that Google is not going to flag up that it's been created by AI, even though it has been created by AI, if that makes sense. So quite exciting times. I'm going to jump out now. So, yes. Proof will be in the pudding. Does this article start appearing in Google? But you can try it out for you, yourself. And as I say, if you look at the link in the description, there is a link there so you can get a free trial and check it out yourself. It's called Content at Scale. And um, you, there'll be videos in there where they explain why it's different. It uses different engines to create these truly unique full articles. And even though we love Scale not and Jasper, they're not quite there yet. So, yeah, tell me what you think about it. Have a try yourself. Give me your opinions and you think it's that better because, as you say, when you get on the website, you'll see that it is more expensive. But if you're going to be using it all the time, it really could help build your website and build that authority. Authority. I'm in the at because I'm in the van in the middle of winter. It's a new look. Uh, we'll see you next time for another one. Thanks for subscribing to the channel and I'll see you soon.